This is Feely from the state of Washington. She is a cashier who has terrible plantar fasciitis for many years. She saw my channel from her son and she saw this video. She has carpal tunnel, low back pain, can't sleep, and brain fog. Her son decided, I want to get treated and came in. He's a truck driver with low back pain. She can hardly stand here because her pain is so bad in her feet and he has low back pain. We saw her x-rays and she has the worst arthritis I've seen in years. See all those hooks? Terrible. He has a high neck reversal, not as much arthritis, but really bad a Alignment. We adjusted Dude, her. Whoa. Oh wow! And we adjusted oh, him. Good. There we go. She has no neck pain, mm -hmm. but all foot pain. And all I'm going to do is adjust her neck. You guys get to watch. And so when you guys are like, why don't you adjust her toes? Why don't you adjust her calcaneus? <laughs> because I don't need to, and you'll see that. It's maybe too much standing, and it's getting worse with my feet. So once, uh, one time, I, my son told me, you better watch this video, Mama, maybe it, it will help. So I was watching that old lady was walking because of the pain in his feet. So that encouraged me to come over here because of that. Says her right heel hurts all the time. Yes. Nine out of 10 pain all the time. Yes. Right? One, 10, yeah. Every, oh, every day, day, right? Yes. It's very painful. Like I cannot grip too much. Like arthritis pain, whatever is that kind gotcha. of. My back hurts also. When gotcha. I, when I sit too much, when I then stand up, it hurt my my back. I sleep like six, maybe six hours. Yeah, she thinks she sleeps well, but she says she's been tired for about five years. <laughs> okay. Right. A little bit and forgot something. Yeah. And she doesn't have a lot of back pain on this, but uh, what do you feel? Yeah, that's all I can do. Why? Because your hamstrings yeah, back here, right? Yeah. And what does it feel like? Tight? Do you feel tight? Yeah. On a scale of 1 to 10, how tight are they? Like 8. Go ahead and stand up, please. Uh, so put your hands on your back, please, and go ahead and lean back. Yeah. How tight is that when you go back? Uh, oh, like 3. 3? Go put oh. your arms down. Oh. Okay. Now look at the floor with your neck. How tight is your neck right there? Anything? Nothing. Look at the ceiling, please. How bad is that? Nothing. Nothing? Uh -huh. Now, she's going to squat to the ground. Spread your feet a little bit and squat to the ground. Uh, uh, how much pain in your knees, your back? Uh, well, like uh, six. Five, six where? Yeah, this one here. In your back, your hamstrings, and your legs? Yeah. Can stand up? Yeah. Good. Uh, now, stand up on your toes for five seconds. Uh, yeah, 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 so, yeah. we'll check her plantar fasciitis now, guys. <laughs> can I hold? <laughs> no, here, don't hold me. Yeah. How much pain in your foot? Like. Uh, Three. Three? Yeah. Gotcha. Her x-rays are messed up. Even though she says she has no neck pain, she has massive arthritis, massive osteophytes, massive infiltration of soft tissue with calcium deposits. And so uh, you're going to see all the damage that can be done from long-standing inability to get proper chiropractic care. Right through the major amount of arthritis. I know that seems counterproductive, but that's where all the damage is done. So we're going to try to create proper motion in here. Okay, whoa. Oh, wow. Wow. Wow what? What wow. are you wowing about? How great I am or how yes. terrible I am? You're great. Yeah, I'm just curious what the wow is about. Oh, I can't really. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. wow. <laughs> Feels good. <laughs> Unbelievable. Unbelievable, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, so you're saying when you went to the chiropractor in Washington, they didn't do that? No. <laughs> no. Yeah. Uh. Come towards me. No. Oh. Good. Wow. Wow. Oh my God. That's one happy lady. <laughs> oh. I just love surprising my patients. It's so awesome to do something that they cannot believe is going to happen. So we're going to help her up here. Remember, no twisting or turning or she'll undo my work. I just can't wait to see how she's doing. Let's listen in, guys. Lighter? Lighter? She was just wanting to go down the hall. So let's get her recalibrated, and uh, I can't wait to see how she's doing. Remember, plantar fasciitis, pain on the feet. And so we're going to see right away if I helped her during that walk down the hallway. Let's listen. Wow. Unbelievable. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> I didn't think she's going to be talking this much. <laughs> I know. Turn around. Uh, you're better on camera uh, than I thought. <laughs> you were made for the camera. Walk one more time. One more time. Oh. Your mother's funny. Holy cow. Uh. Did you hear think she's going to talk this much? She was so quiet. Good job. 
<laughs> I don't feel pain. Look, my no more pain in my Aww. right foot. No way. No. Really? No. no Come pain. on. Yes. <laughs> How long have you been suffering the pain for? A uh, long time. Long time? <laughs> yeah. Like, how much has it hurt your life to have this pain? Oh, oh it's like 10. Long time. Long time. I cannot remember. But really, I, there's nothing there. Oh, see? And this is, you've had this for how long again? Oh, like three or four years. And how long did that take to get treated? <laughs> yes, the keep pushing, the pain is gone. I keep pushing that leg. Every time I came from bed, I cannot stand up straight because of the pain. Oh, what do you think of this? It's instant. really instant. <laughs> Just like your son said. He goes, it really, I can't get over it. It's instant. Yeah. It's instant. Let's go I back in the room. Let's take I a look. I don't believe it. You don't <laughs> no, believe it? No, I mean, I know I believe it. <laughs> Well, really, unbelievable. Oh my God. That was an eight out of 10. Look at, <laughs> hey! Oh That's yeah, no pain, no pain. <sighs> <sighs> Look at that, the sun's like, put me on camera now, I wanna <laughs> see. <laughs> go oh. ahead, go back. Nah, wow, I can reach that. <laughs> he did the same thing, he did the, he did the oh, same wow, thing. Wow, wow. That's hilarious. Ah, <sighs> <sighs> oh, wow. Yep. Okay, look down the floor. Look down the floor with your neck. You had no pain before, right? Look at the ceiling. Nope. No pain. No, no pain? Way. Okay, now the fun one. Squat. <gasps> that was a seven or eight. I forgot what it was. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, holy cow. <laughs> <laughs> that was seven yeah. or eight a minute ago, wasn't it? Yeah, I can do it again. Can't do it again. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Like stretching, what do you call it? Stretching here? A stretching, but tight. any pain? No pain. But I can feel the muscles stretches, but no pain. Oh. You want the magic one now? Want the magic one? <laughs> on the toes, baby. No, 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 we gotta hold you. Stand up on your toes. Oh, the toes. I want the toes. I can do it. Oh, wow. <laughs> Look at her ballerina. <laughs> <laughs> and that was a three out of 10 a minute Yeah, ago. no pain. No pain. Oh, this praise God. Now I can do my exercises. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank walking, you, for, thank you very much for the video. You want to tell anybody You're else anything? Yeah. Please come. Whatever your pain you have, <laughs> it's really true. <laughs> <laughs> this is not just a drama. This is real. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, thank you so much. Yes. God bless. Thank you. See you guys next time. Hi, Dr. Thayer here. I'm with uh, the scaredy cat and the mother. Uh, why don't you tell us how you did Ernesto? Because he had one adjustment, she has had one adjustment. This is only there. This is gonna be your second adjustment. So how did you do last night? Uh, I felt pretty good. After the adjustment, I felt like a feather. It was so light. I felt very flexible. Touched my toes and bending back. And then in a couple hours after that, walking around, I felt taller. Felt taller. Like, Something been stretched out. Yeah, right. <laughs> so his claim to fame, why I wanted him to do the video earlier, is because he is a truck driver. He's been to different chiropractors in five different states. He's seen easily 11 chiropractors. He's been to the joint, seen ton, been to the tons of the joint chiropractors, and been to lots of private practice doctors. Yeah. Why don't yeah. you tell us the difference between what we had happen here yesterday and all those years of finding other chiropractors, all the difference. What's the difference between what I do and all that stuff? Uh, what you do here is just a neck, but the way you adjust the neck, it's so intense and deep, like really targeted with where it needs to be adjusted. Mm -hmm. The other places I went, it's just like, like I don't feel anything. Yeah. Yeah, right here is so deep and then, you know. What about the result? Did you ever have this kind of result with any other chiropractor? No, no. When I, when I left with the other chiropractors, I even hurt when I leave the office. Yes. Over here, when I leave, I feel like a feather, like I'm a brand new person. Wow, well, brand new person, right. Well, yes. How do you sleep compared to usual? Um, uh, a little bit better than before. When I, I noticed that when I lie down in bed, it was so painful before that. Now, last night, oh, something wrong. It's 
it's not painful anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Good. She's still really nervous. You can see her eyes twitching. Ugh. Good girl. Oh. Go side. Ah. Just come towards me. Uh. Good. Ah. Uh. Good, 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 good. Ah. Uh. And really get that shit <laughs> down there. Like <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's work on your side now. He was really tough to adjust it yesterday. Really tough. Can you feel it, huh? Uh huh. Yeah. Tight. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> He's tighten up a little bit. Oh, Good. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Easier than yesterday. Way easier. Yesterday was like I had to give a double clutch move where I had to really, really get in there and push because it didn't go at all the first time. He couldn't even do this before. How long since you've been able to touch the floor like that? Like 10 years ago. And this was the funny part. Look at he, He's like a freaking gymnast. I can go way, way far. He couldn't do that at all, yeah. at all, at Very all. Very flexible. Yeah. Thanks for doing the video. I mean, mm -hmm. I talked to him the video. I can't believe that. And he did it with his mother. So uh, awesome. So um, I hope you guys appreciate that. Uh, have a shout out for these guys. I mean, they did it together. I haven't done a video like that in a long time. So see you guys next time. What have you guys learned in the last couple hours? I learned that you have to follow instructions from doctor. Good, good, good. Mm -hmm. I like that. Because if you miss all the instructions, everything is messed up. Like what I do this time. Yeah, good. Uh, yeah. Yeah. What did you find out? What was the problem? The, so it's. It's the procedure. It's the procedure, so I, right? Yeah. And so I, I taught them the something, they followed the procedure, and you came back. How much pain did you have in the last couple hours in your foot? Less. <laughs> Same thing. Uh, if I don't walk the right way with the right posture, mm -hmm. then I, I feel pain. Yeah. How much better are you overall? 80%. Full x-ray report, guys. This is a twofer. One with horrible arthritis and the son of the one with horrible arthritis. So you guys can compare and check it out. Let's listen in. The pink line is the center of mass for your body, Ernesto, okay? And so you want to see where your head is. Your head is right of center by 7.85 millimeters. See that? So that is our first leverage point. So your body is pulling that way, which creates muscle spasm on the left side of the body. Mm -hmm. You see this line right here, this pink line? That is massive tilt. Your head is tilted to the right. And so that's more than usual. So that's, again, additional force to the right. Then that additional force does what? It causes more leverage. That leverage causes more torque, right? Okay, so we also, this arrow points to which way your body's leaning. You also have a TMJ issue here. Your left jaw, right here, there's less space here and more space here. So your jaw is shifted to the left. You can see how this jaw, and so why do I point that out? Well, tension in your jaw will also affect your neck. Wow. So grinding, clenching, popping of your jaw will affect your neck too. Okay, in your low back, you have some more scoliosis down here. So you have a little bit of curve to your back. You have a 12.6 degree curve here, a 10 degree curve here. Uh, right leg is shorter than the left leg. Okay. The interesting thing on you is that you have about a 12 millimeter difference between this width and this width. So your whole body is not only scoliotic here, but you have a rotational component to you. Uh, this arrow points to <coughs> constipation. Side view shows me arthritis. Tons of arthritis between your shoulder blades. Arthritis, arthritis, arthritis. Here's a big arthritis right here, L2, L3. Arthritis, these little hooks right here are arthritis. And that's constipation right there. So the neck should be shaped like this yellow line. No more C-curve. Uh, no more C-curve, exactly. <laughs> uh, he's been to, this guy's been to 11 chiropractors. Mm -hmm. uh, by the way, how many chiropractors take x-rays of your, of your spine, of all those? Do they all take x-rays? No, no, maybe only three. Three? Gotcha. Yeah. So uh, do you think this is important to see what's going on? Yeah. I sort of think yeah. it is too. So this curve should be like this yellow line. So this arrow points to where I think the biggest problem on you is. This is C2, C3. So the upper neck is your biggest problem. This arrow points to your atlas, which is not that bad a shape. This is just the problem right here. This arrow points to some arthritis in here. You have yeah. the most arthritis I've seen in a long time, okay? Mm -hmm. And so this pink line right here is again center of mass. You can see how you went to the right, she goes to the left Ooh, with her head. Nice. Opposite, right? You guys are bookends. <laughs> her left TMJ is off like yours, and she has this radical head tilt up here. All these are imbalances that make things worse, guys. So I hope you guys appreciate that wa watching these two uh, x-rays back to back. You guys can compare and contrast online to see how the differences are. But this is what he will look like if he didn't have treatment here. And so her whole right side is arthritic in her back. She has a lot more constipation. Again, a lot more arthritis on the right side of the body, not the left as much. She has tons of arthritis in her hips. Not her hips per se, but her, her ilium, which is the yeah. high hip. She has a really bad old, old, old balance yeah. issue. Yeah, I know. 
Okay. So side view shows more of the arthritis, tremendous amount of arthritis, really sclerotic, really bad. Mm. See these little humps right here? These bones are growing together. They're actually just, they're just, wow. it's, again, she has pretty terrible arthritis. Pretty significant. I would say top 5% of all my patients ever. Maybe top 3%. The arthritis is not causing her pain. The arthritis is a symptom of the pain. Her neck. Her neck is, this is all these arrows are all freaking tons of arthritis. This is terrible arthritis. She has it so bad in her neck. Uh, every single bone is arthritic. But she has, these. see these things right here? See this right here? Those are osteophytes. The biggest I've seen in years. That broke off of there 10 years ago. This one's still connected right here. This one broke off. 15 years ago and you can see how smooth that is and they were hooks that grew off the bone and she pushed her neck one time and they just snap off they just snap off so these things are floating inside the soft tissue why is that important to see it shows you how bad she is this is evidence of how long she's been out of balance <laughs> atlas is way way too small it's it's microscopic in here it should be way bigger than this and that just tells me again that unhealthy it's been unhealthy for a long time oh i just saw this right now look at this huh? uh, bam Woo! osteophyte right right there see that right there guys i just i just saw that heading back to room number two to take a look at arthritis take a look at this one this is how your neck's supposed to look okay your curve goes the wrong way right her curve is not as bad but again it's sort of a lie she's it, she's hurt it so much that she has to, she has to force to change it back but yeah. again, if you look at these bones, how smooth they are, Yeah. no arthritis. See how black these are in between? How yeah. nice and smooth these bones look? Yeah. And where the atlas is. Yeah. So like, that's, a, that's normal, okay? Mm -hmm. This is abnormal spine. Left long enough, it turns into this arthritis right here. And then left long enough, turns into here. You, Ernesto's about here. Yours is almost down here already. It's not quite here, but it's leaning towards this way more than this. See, these, these right here, that's pretty bad, but yours are three times bigger than that, these hooks. And they've actually broken up into the soft tissue, so you're almost here. Whoa. Stop! For this science moment! We're talking about arthritis today. Arthritis is the abnormal wearing of joints that cause distortion of the disc space and the bones that can't be changed. So let me show you what arthritis looks like. Here's a good spine, and here's the worst and you can see the different phases that people pass through. So we can tell how bad somebody is by following where they are on this continuum. The analogy I like to use is tires on a car. If your car is misaligned, what will happen to those tires? Will they start balding on the inside or the outside? So what can you do on a car? You can replace the tires, but on the human body you can't, and that's arthritis. Here's another example of arthritis and how it progresses. Good spine leads to a bad one, bad one, worse, worse, worse. And you end up over here if you do nothing about it. I hope this educational moment was helpful. Turn this way. Why are you shaking? Still scared? Yeah. <laughs> Turn this way. Oh. Oh. Yeah, she doesn't like to relax. That's mm -hmm. her problem. I, remember, I try. Yeah, she tries, but again, when you've had pain as many years as she has, mm -hmm. um, it's hard to let anybody touch you because yeah. it hurts. Come towards me. Oh, wow. Good. Good. Rah. And so all you guys out there will probably be like, how do you adjust her with such bad arthritis? Uh, Again, I adjust right through the freaking arthritis, guys, because that's uh, where the most damage is done. The last time, the reason why I came here because I cannot squeeze my hands, so it is zero now. I cannot sit longer because my this one is hurting me, which is zero. My lower back before is painful, now zero. My left, uh, my, right foot, my, right my foot. sorry, my right foot before was eight, so nine maybe something. Now it's a tiny inch. Okay. I don't know what an inch is, but we're, you guys get the feeling that you know what we're talking about, right? I mean, she says it with such conviction, I think we all understand, right? <laughs> okay, but so. you have to follow instructions, okay? If you miss the instructions, you miss up everything. So just follow instructions. Good, wow, well, that's nice. Yeah. Am I nice about, am I nice about giving instructions? <laughs> yes. Am I nice? Yeah, nice. Am I nice? Yeah, nice. Oh, yeah, 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 right. Uh, it's been tough. 
you gotta really follow instructions again uh, walk posture and all that you know if you don't do it right you're gonna feel pain again yes <laughs> but when he says he feels pain again it's like a two out of ten it's yeah. minor compared to what it was yeah, minor. so anything else you want to add Ernesto um, I'm just saying feel I really come here I go, so how does it feel to be in no pain? He goes, you know, when I was a kid, I had no pain. And now I'm kind of feeling like I'm a kid again. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, wow, what a great way to say it. What part of the body have I adjusted? That's the neck. Have I adjusted anything else in your body? No. Have I stretched your body anywhere? No. Have I touched your foot at all? No. Have I rubbed your foot at all? No. Nothing. Just adjust the neck. Just adjust the neck. That's it, right? <sighs> That's good. Hmm? Ah. Good. Good. Ah. Uh. Oh, okay. Good. Good. Uh. Okay. We were laughing about him this morning. He's still scared of my adjustments. <laughs> Even after him helping so and you can see his eyes, see his eyes right now, they're not twitching. And they're starting to twitch. I just yeah. talked about it. He started to twitch. So after I adjust him, he starts getting scared. I go, you're still scared? He goes, I am scared still. Nice. Dude. Not bad. And now on your toes, please. Balancing. Look, she looks like a ballerina. <laughs> Nothing. Yeah. Good. Yep. So, uh, thanks for doing the video. I know you didn't want it. She didn't want it at all, guys. She, I had yeah. to beg her to do this. And I did it for you guys because you guys don't believe how much a neck adjustment can help yeah. a foot pain. Yeah. So I wanted to show you that plantar fasciitis can get better with a neck adjustment. I know you guys are gonna believe this. A neck adjustment, I know you guys are gonna believe this. Yeah, but a neck adjustment does it. Okay, so I didn't touch anything else, huh? Nothing, Good. just the neck. Just the neck. So thank you very much for the video. You're welcome. Can yeah. I kiss you now? Oh, yeah, yeah. Ah, thank so. you. <laughs> I asked for that earlier, by the way. So. <laughs> She's, I go, no, 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 hold on. Wait till we get on camera. So, I go, oh, I know you wanna kiss me, but wait, 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 wait. wait. Thank you. Thank you. Say goodbye, Alice. Bye. <laughs>